Do you want to turn a simple photo into a cinematic 3D scene like this? Let me show you an easy and efficient way to recreate realistic environments right inside Blender. No complicated steps, just smart techniques. All right, start with a cool reference image, something with proper lighting and clear perspective. Use FSpy to match the camera perspective with the image. Align every line carefully. Hold Shift to zoom in for precision. As you can see, it looks perfect. Now import it into Blender, and let's begin the modeling. Add a cube, then start extruding it according to the image. Add an edge loop, then extrude it on the z-axis to block out the main part. Now add more edge loops and remove that face. Basically, we're just modeling a rough mesh. Once that's done, let's create the window. Simply add edge loops, then extrude it. Now remove these parts so it looks good. Now duplicate the window and add it to different sides. Now add material and use the main image as a texture. Then unwrap the UVs. And this is how it looks. Now select the front side and start fixing its UV. Align these edge lines of the UVs. Once that's done, let's move on to the next one and repeat the same process. All right, now for the back and top side, I have used a different texture of wood plank. Now we will create this dust bin. Simply add a cube, then extrude it on top and start adding small details. Now we will add texture and fix the UVs using the same method we did earlier. Once that's done, let's create this thing.
Alright, now we will create the ground by just adding a plane and increasing its size. Now let's import our 3D assets and align them according to the scene. Now here's the best part, texturing the ground. To create this highly detailed texture, here's what I did. First, I added this dirt texture, then I added this cobblestone texture, and I combined both textures by creating this alpha map. That's easy, just add a noise texture along with a color ramp, mapping and coordinate nodes, then add a shader and combine it. This is how I got this cool texture. Repeat the same process for the road as well. You can get these textures from Polyhaven or Ambient CG. After that, let's start adding more assets. I have used a particle system for these trees, then added this dead tree. Then I added this mailbox. For more detail, I added these tires. After that, I added these electric poles and used curves for the wires. Now we will add cars. By the way, to save some time, I didn't model these cars by myself. I found them on Sketchfab. After that, let's add grass on the ground. Once everything is imported, now let's move on to the lighting. This is how our scene looks with only HDRI. First, enable the fog. Then add the sunlight so it reflects as moonlight. Then add these street lights. Add one light inside the garage. After that, add these two harsh lights in the back so the scene looks better. Add one light to the left side so it won't look too dark. And after that, add a few more lights in the front. After adding all that stuff and doing some color grading, that's how you can build a cinematic, photo-based 3D scene. Fast, clean, and detailed. If you'd like to explore this project or want more scenes like this, it's available right now on my Patreon. Link is available in the description. Thank you for watching. Please let me know what you'd like to see next.